What's up, friends? This is Jazz bringing you another episode of Pokemon White. In the last episode, we caught some Pokemon. We got Zuko and Alan and Lassie. Now we are going to go and see what it is all about. Yeah, 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 yeah. We, I know where the Pokemon Center is. Sure. Really? You don't want to tell us who it is? Oh yeah, you can buy items there. Battle, I wonder who Panel is. Oh, hi Bianca. Anyway guys, I'm deciding who to keep on my team. For now, I have only three Pokemon, but I think Lassie, you're good, but I might... I think I'm going to put Lassie in the box for now. I apologize, Lassie, but I want to be a little different with this playthrough, and a lot of people are using the final evolution of Lassie. Maybe I'll go back to you later, old girl, but... Plus, I don't want to be too mimicky of Bianca and Sharon. Wait. Do I want to use Zuko or Ellen? I think I'll use Zuko. There's gonna be a battle coming up here. Oh, something's going on in the plasma. Here, second. My name is Getsis. I am here representing Team Plasma. Today, ladies and gentlemen, I would like to talk to you about Pokemon Liberation. I'm sure most of you believe what that we humans of Pokemon are partners that have come to live together because we want and need each other. However, is that really the truth? Have you ever considered that perhaps we humans only assume that this is the truth? Pokemon are subject to the selfish commands of trainers. They get pushed around when they are our partners at work. Can anyone say with confidence that there is no truth in what I'm saying? Now, ladies and gentlemen, Pokemon are different from humans. They are living beings that contain our no potential. They are living beings from whom we hope we humans have much to learn. Tell me, what is our responsibility toward these wonderful beings called Pokemon? That's right! We must liberate the Pokemon! Then and only then will humans and Pokemon truly be equals. Everyone, I end my words here today by imploring you consider the relationship between people and Pokemon, and the correct way to proceed. We sincerely appreciate your attention. In that case... Bye, dear uh, villain! I mean, um, liberator! Really, though? Is it not obvious? Yeah, it isn't any possible, and oh yeah, here's another nut case. But I don't mind this one as much. Your Pokemon, just now, it was saying... Fast. 
but while talking. That's an odd thing to say. Yes, they're talking. Oh, then you can't hear it either. How sad. My name is N. My name is Sharon, and this is Jazzy. We're asked to complete the Pokedex, and we left. We just left on our journey. My main goal is to become the champion, y'all. The Pokedex, ah? Uh? So, you're going to combine many, many Pokemon and Pokeballs for that, then? I'm a trainer, too, but I can't help wondering. Are Pokemon really happy that way? Well, Jazzy, is it? Let me hear your Pokemon's voice again. I love this guy. You'll see why later. You've seen my other playthrough of this know what in store. But I just love this guy. Come on, Suko! Show me why Pokemon and humans are good together. I'm not even gonna use Tackle. I'm just gonna do... Ember, cause that is probably the most logical thing to do. Oh, that's so stupid. He's just gonna do growl over and over again! Or not. Wow. Ah! I'm gonna do Ember Tackle. Ember Tackle. Ah! Ah! Level 8 for Suko! Good job! I never expected to hear Pokemon say such things! As long as Pokemon are confined in Pokeballs, Pokemon will never become perfect beings. I have to change the world for Pokemon because they are my friends! I just love that voice I gave him. Yeah, but he does have a point. I mean, I take him more seriously than I do Gatsis. Yeah, that was interesting. Let's go heal. Hold on a second, I want to check something out. Guess I was wrong. There's some things that I want to check here first. Thanks. I didn't know we resembled each other so much. I suppose. I mean, this is- this music's catchy. Okay, good to know. Yep, I have a bag that can store anything. Yeah, I love this, what's important. Mm. 
I wonder who the hero is. I like this guy you get a Pokeball from the future or the past. This girl pretty much plays a rock, paper, scissors type of thing here with you, so she's not as important. Oh, hi, Patrat. The music is quite catchy. Let's talk to this girl. Yeah, I know we're going slow now, but we could be going a lot slower. Now we... Oh, really? Is this gonna be another Pokemon Soul Silver fiasco? Oh, Mom, are you, are you, are you and the ball from Soul Silver getting together? Wait, wait, you called to talk to me, but now you're gonna hang up. Why? What, Mom? Wait, okay, you're worse than Soul Silver's mom. You're following me now. Well, I suppose you're not abandoning me. Oh, thank you. Now I can go faster? I'm going to get a rare candy to to Ellen. There's one new Pokemon that you can acquire here. We get a potion, and that's not the Pokemon that we can acquire, but... Of course not. What the actual F? What the actual- Thank you! Woo! Hello, Ends Pokemon! Well, I'm actually glad you did that! Go! You know what? I'm going to name this guy Vegeta. I'm keeping him only for a little bit because Vegeta. Vegeta. Might as well take a look at Vegeta, actually. I mean, I don't want to really use Vegeta because, will this say Sharon is already using him? And then, ooh, an equally rounded Pokemon. You know what? I might use Vegeta for a little bit, but just for a little bit. Just to add extra beef to the team. You learned to sis?
but he's not gonna be my main beef. Alright, so let's go! Go, Ellen! You're playing smart, are ya? Tackle! Oh. Smart. Oh, what? Come on, tackle! Bye. Really? And you got a purloin. I think purloin's gonna be growling, right? Or scratching me, whatever you choose. Jeez. Yeah, I figured. I figured that wouldn't last forever. Come on, Ellen. Ah, you don't have another Pokemon, so assist will not work. Ah, shoot. And of course. Oh, hi, Lily Pop. Take care of them, Melon. You only have a level to go. Pack up! Yeah, level 9! I'm gonna get everyone else up to level 9 while I'm at it. Oh, well, I think I'm gonna do a potion first. Oh, shit! Oh, well. Alright, we got ourselves up to level 10. Hmm. I'm gonna go and switch out. Ah, you got a lily pop, huh? Roll in. I'm going to use a potion. I'm thinking of putting uh, Vegeta back in the box when I get to Strike. Because there's another Pokemon I want to get over that right now. Oh no. 
Oh, hi, Bianca. Yeah. You know, the music is really too cheerful for me. For a rival battle anyway. No! Oh, my rat! Yeah. Oh, okay, that hurt. I'm going to snipe. I'm going to little Zuko here. I'm trying to go opposite of three rivals here. I'm curious whether Charon actually found a purloin in the grass we went in. Because he only has two Pokemon and it's a purloin. But yet you can't get one until Route 3. There's some items here. Two thread items here. We got a potion and a Pokeball. I mean, I don't want to be too much the same as. As Bianca or Sharon. I want to have my own, you know, style. I mean, like, there's a few Pokemon that it's interesting, but I wouldn't, um, want them really because of the style there. I mean, I think I'll always be copying them away or so, but I'm gonna go into Dream right now, just for a minute, because there is a Pokemon here. Shoot, I'm gonna be battling anyway, so who do I need to train? I'm gonna train Alan right now. All right, let's train together. Airy, purloin, huh? Oh no, you're doing assist. Damn it, thanks a lot, pal. That's the last thing I need. I hate you, you know that, Furloin. You're, you're a real pain in the ass. A real pain in the butt. Ouch. Ow! That hurt! You meanie! Another annoying pain in the ass, Furloin. Are, are you kidding me? Oh, shoot. Ow! I probably should have healed. I'm healing now. I'm healing. There's a Pokemon here that we're getting that I'm looking forward to using. Ah. Oh, I hate you. OMG! I mean, really there, Purloin! Pain in the ass, cat! Ow. Tackle! Of course you're using assist! I'm starting to hate that attack now. I really am. I like it when there's no other Pokemon, but... Good job.
almost level 11 for this pretty girl. <sighs> of course! Well, if I beat you, that means I can help perform a gym leader then, right? Joey, really? Of course you were, like, of course you would have Patrat. Is your Patrat top percentage of Patrat? I wouldn't think so. Because my Patrat is top percentage of Patrat. Bye bye. We got detect. Oh no! Is your patrat the top percentage of patrat? Well, you know what? I'm going out to Suko. Suko needs some EXP too. Wah! Go Porky! Okay, actually, his name is Suko, but. So Porky's a little mean. I also like to call them Baconator. Although I no longer like them, so. That would be insult to my Suko. I'm a limit first to go! And Lollipop, 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 go! At least you don't just have a... Patrat, Patrat, Patrat! Blah! Taco! Taco! Nope, you didn't do well at all. Here we are. Yes, I want the pants out. But it's mine now. This is our next ticket here. Alright, Pants Age. What am I going to name you? I have the perfect day for you. No, no, no. I need it. I need a capital P, thank you very much. Pickle. You know, Dragon Dragon Ball. And if I spell it wrong, I am so sorry. Piccolo. Alright. Get the item here, which is the next defend, which would also be very nice. Let's check out a little Piccolo here. Your quirky nature. So, you... Well, pretty much a solid attacker, but more of a special attack. Thanks a lot! I would have loved a special attack boost. I mean, I would have loved an attack boost. But, eh, things happen. I'm going to give a few levels to each of you guys. You know what, I am going to get rid of Detect because really, Sand Attack would be better for everyone. Detect's only good for Ellen. Okay, let me see. Ugh. You know what, I'm getting rid of Fury Swipes. Alright, we got a level 13 Piccolo. I'm going to be using Piccolo later, or during this gym battle particularly. And he'll also be useful for later on in the game. Alright, let's see, we have a...
Let's battle this guy. Hey Jazzy, have you come to... Yep. Lucky, I have the right Pokemon out. Go, Piccolo. Lear, Lear, that all she want. Bad whip. Bye, all she wanty. You're, so you think your purloin is good? Go, Ellen! Huh. You know what I'm gonna do, guys? I know I could easily get this out of the way, but I am going to be a pain in the ass to this little M. F. I am gonna be a pain in the ass. Come on, what are you gonna do to me? Well, tackle, sure. And now I'm just gonna tackle ya. Oh, really? Really there, Purloin? Really? Ah. Uh. Ow. Well, I'm doing this stupid Santa cat. I hate you. I'm being a date. People keep spamming me. Ha ha! Bye, kitty! I, I just could not resist. They kept spamming me with purloin. I wanted to do the same thing. I had one of those dark feelings in my head. You know, kill, kill. Yeah, okay. Okay. We got a full heal! Now it's making me think of full house. I better shut up. I feel like singing everywhere you- Okay, yeah. Uh. Sure, I know how they do so, whatever. Well, we got this done. Ah, hello. Jim, in that case, chose. Type. Alright, Silent. Too bad I'm not gonna be battling you. Oh, hi, Clyde, the gym guy. Oh, thank you. Thank you so much for the fresh water. Now, I have to go for the thing that is weak against it, or weak to, or strong against it. Welcome to Striking Gym! Sure. Now, the, these guys will have a normal and different types, so... It's a different, like experience here than in, in most first gyms where you expect what they are. I am gonna go on with Stupid. Probably not 
the smartest move. Let's switch out. Ow. Ember! That's a lot better than Fine Whip does, that's for sure. Ember away! Ember me timbers! I am going to switch Alan. I need to go into the grass symbol. We're doing the gym this time, folks, and then in the next episode, we'll go in another city. The specialty of Stride Gym, the full course trainer deluxe. I'm your second course. Oh, you're my second course, are you? And you have two, so... Ah, hello, Patrat. I have my own Patrat. My Patrat is the top percentage of Patrat. And yes, I'm being a pain in the butt. I know I could easily be doing bite or something, but I want the stab at this point. Oh, hi, Perloin! Shed attack! Ooh. Shed attack! That's one thing I hate about these... these Pokemon. Yeah. Sand attack! Oh, you're doing an assist. Ouch. Oh my god, that's a stab. OMG. OMG. That, 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 not good. That, not good at all. How do you get so lucky? Damn it. Oh my god! Use your sand attack! Do it as all your might! Ha! Come on. Ah! Ah, hi! You suck. Boom. Now we're going to switch out for Zuko because the first no first Pokemon I can handle and we need just to go straight ahead to fire welcome to the Striking City Pokemon gym I'm chili I like things up with fire type Pokemon I'm a water type specialist and my name is Crass. Pleased to make your acquaintance. And my name is Silent. I like grass type Pokemon. Um, you see, as for why the three of us are all here, is well, uh. Oh, enough! Listen up! The three of us will decide who will battle. It'll be based on the type of the first Pokemon you chose. That is indeed correct. And the partner you first chose was fire type, it seems. That is correct. It shall be me, 
and with each of the eye and my esteemed water types that you must face in battle. Um, Cress, do you realize that like only one of your Pokemon are water? Water types? You only have one water type! What incredible luck for you! You get to battle the best among the three of us! Oh, are I lucky! I just thought they each have their own accent. And we're chasing Leader Crest! Now, this is a first for me. I believe last time I had. What? Did I face Crest last time too? Now, this, this is scary. I'm just embering away. But this one is a lot higher of a level. OMG. That, that is worrisome. That, that's their scheme. That's their plan. This music always gets me. Oh my god. Okay. And of course, yes, I figure it. <laughs> At least he's wasting it on this guy. Alright. Come on, Zuko! Oh! Good job, Zuko, buddy. Now we have Panpour, the one water type he owns on his team. Monkey against Monkey! Although yours is slightly higher. Oh. Oh, I love this music! Oh my god, this music is catchy! Monkey against Monkey! Oh my god. That, that will be dangerous. Ah! Oh my god, no. Please survive an attack! Come on! Let it tickle! Oh my god, it tickled! <gasps> Loops me? I don't believe this! Believe it, buddy! Why? You're quite remarkable! It is the Pokemon League's rule, so please take this badge. We got the trio badge from Crass. Our first badge of the Unova region, but you know that already from my last Let's Player, Nuzlocke. Not as much pressure this time. Wait, why does he have to switch around to give me the T-Ab? Jip, or, and to explain it, Jip badges are proof of a trader's ability. If you have one badge, put one, including trade it, put one up to level 20, we'll obey you without question. We also want you to have this. Now this is the TM they use in the battle workup. This is good, trust me. Now anyway, I believe that Silent is the most popular of these three, which is why he explain, like, as, which is why he explained the badge and gave you the TM. Obviously, Cress had to give you the badge because you battled him, but he always, like, Silent always does the most talking here. Before we end the episode, who in my team now can learn work up? I know that Piccolo can. And I am planning to teach him that. Oh my god, yes. Lear, goodbye. Let's see what I can do. I, yeah, I figure Tip they couldn't, but I'm lucky. Alright. Hmm. Getting rid of Bye, that's not very useful right now. I have a. I need something to raise my attack for Ellen, so. But I, I did pretty good. I have a good team so far. But anyway, if you enjoyed this episode, give it a big thumbs up. I make videos every single day. So I'll see you in the next episode of Pokemon. Let's play Pokemon White. I'll see you guys next time. Bye.